about entrepreneurship is that you don't have to adhere to the nine to five schedule that you'll see in the most corporate environments. So I, I love hearing about different entrepreneurs schedules. They're always really weird and I figured we could just share ours with you to give you a slice of how weird they can become. So Malcolm, it, how does your work day start? So I generally wake up around 1 a.m. and I work from uh, 1 a.m to five and then I greet Simone when she wakes up and then I'll work for about another hour then I'll sleep for a few hours and then I'll work a bit more and then I'll play video games the rest of the day uh and what about you Simone and then I go to bed fairly early yeah like 9 p.m at the latest 7 30 p.m if he wants to start work early yeah he's a weirdo but so am I I guess I go to bed at 9 p.m I wake up at 5 a.m uh, start my day with three hours of work from an elliptical machine, which is so amazing because I get an exercise high that gives me double focus and double speed. Then I she literally sets up her her her, her PC like her de her laptop on the elliptical and in 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 works for three hours while she's on the elliptical. It's standing nuts. desk on steroids. Efficiency, efficiency. So then after that, naturally, I have to eat a humongous meal, and I take ninety minutes to do that. Um, and then I work solid until 5.30 or 6 p.m. and then have dinner and then basically go to sleep and start again the next day. But it's a fantastic way to get in a lot of work. And honestly, when you're doing what you would do anyway if you're on vacation every single day because you love your work, it works out. Oh, but someone needs to go to bed soon. <laughs> no, that's a lie. It's bedtime. I mean, he, he got up at 1. That's a lie. Okay. Okay. <laughs>